Hello, collective. It's for you, Aquarius. I love my Aquarius collective. I'm an Aquarius and I love you, my Aquarians. I appreciate you so much. I've, I've received a lot of support from you. And if you're a new Aquarius, please hit subscribe today. Or if you like an Aquarius, just whatever it is, uh, you know, please hit subscribe. I love you guys. And I'm grateful for each and every one of you all that's on my channel. I'm trying to give back to my collective. Uh, I'm trying to get to 500, and I'm, I'm struggling with that collective uh, um, because somebody has done something to my channel, and I know they did, and I know when they did it, and I know that it was the reader that did that out thing because I've, I've, I've researched back in my channel, and the law is going to be watching. You're going to have to release all this that you got from me. You're going to have to let it go. You're going to have to release it back to Aquarius, okay, reader? All right. Sorry, Collective, I had to say that. Innocence, look through fresh eyes. Yeah, somebody, somebody's watching everything you do. They, you ain't never had to work a day in your life for jack shit. No, boy, them people stupid, ain't they, Collective? They're the stupidest sons of bitches I ever seen now. They have to be. Don't wish that you had someone else's life collective. Make the life that you want. I'm trying to help you all. I'm trying to help you now. Shit. Somebody wants to mend their friendship with you. I just saw it. Oh, this is about your deepest desires. It's been constraining you. The tree of wishes is calling your name. An almost forgotten wish will now come true. Oh, wow. Your deepest desires that's been holding you back. Your wish is coming true. Your wish is coming true. A wonderful surprise is coming to you, my dear. Something entirely new awaits you. Tear down the walls around your heart. Tear those walls down and give and receive security and warmth. Ooh, that's what somebody's wanting to do with you, Aquarius. They want to live playfully and with a light heart. They listen to the voice of their inner child because you taught them this Aquarius and they appreciate you. And they said, you have this beautiful aura of a purple glowing light around you. And I love you and I love you Aquarius and I love you Aquarius. And if you love me, hit like, if you love me and you like my cards and I do different than others, because I'm helping you all to release your creative energies. Make use of them in your life. You all need to create the, your life the way like I'm trying to teach, okay? Because success and happiness are coming to you because you fall, you keep following your vision. Never lose sight of what's important to you. You're awakening all your senses and you're awakening the magic of creativeness inside of you. The lotus within awakens. This is your sole purpose, your own baby. Don't you think that it ain't now, honey? Because it surely is now. I'm going to do this uh, tarot right here today, you guys, because it's for Halloween. That's why. It looks like little bloody, creepy vampires and werewolves and mummies. And, well, you know how it is at Halloween, you guys. That's what it is. That's how it is, you guys. Oh, it is, my gosh. Uh, Spirit, can we please help the collective with a clear, concise message? I love you and I thank you. Uh, somebody is walking after you. That song says a Foo Fighters on the TV right now. Oh, it says ten of wands upside down. Somebody's been, they was doing magic on you. See that shit? They've been doing like me, uh, devil worshiping magic, maybe. See that goat skull up there? <coughs> um, yeah, somebody's doing some candle magic on you, and, they're, and it's, they're using voodoo bones. See them animal bones? Or human bones. Take it as it is, but you, you're, you're letting these burdens go. Uh-huh. You, you're, you're, um, you're not wanting to hang on to shit that you've already outgrown. You're trying to move away from this way of doing. You put a death to, the, you're putting a death to something that's constraining you. 
you're ending that because you're tired of it. The Grim Reaper's coming. Maybe somebody actually is getting ready to die because this person has been, uh, or you yourself has been constraining yourself to the house and you need to stop doing that, Aquarius. Uh, yep, you're uh, six of swords. You're you're get you're you're moving from choppy, rough seas to calm waters. This death is going to bring calmness in your life. This could be a real death coming or a death to feeling trapped up. This is Knight of Pentacles. This is the slowest moving knight in the deck. I think you're moving away from being trapped up in your head, waiting on something, waiting on this person that's never coming to you, Aquarius. You gotta sail away from waiting on that. Put it, surrender that shit to the divine. If somebody really loves you, they'll let you know, all right? Yeah, you got to get out of this Confucius mindset. You you had to because you made a wish and it's coming true. You gotta tire them walls down around your heart and go towards what's in your heart. You gotta go towards that. Because you got a lot of options at the moment, okay? But you're only wanting love in one of them, Aquarius, and the rest with all these nice things. That's what it is. Uh, and then we got Three of Wands. This is about you. Uh, this You've been waiting on this person to show you a sign, or they've been waiting on you. They've been waiting on you. But you're gonna have to get your mind from this confusing mindset of which way do I go? Maybe someone's been lying and they did magic, said that they was gonna die and maybe you've been staying with that person for that reason. You need to move away from that because they're just wanting to keep you stuck and waiting. Somebody's just wanting to keep you stuck and waiting. They want you to feel confused. They they know you have a lot of options and that you only love one and they're waiting on you. What's the outcome, Spirit? What's the outcome? You're gonna be uh you're gonna be a success in your business, Nine of Pentacles. You're showing independence. Uh, you're tired of bending over backwards for everybody else and not tending to your own self. You're, you're, you're waiting on your ships to come in and you've got a lot of options coming to you, baby. What about this 10 of wands upside down? Oh, we got eight of wands. Ooh, you're getting ready to receive a message about Whoever this was that was doing magic, death magic to you, they're, they're trying to steal, they're trying to put a death to your finances or your relationship. Somebody is trying to put a death to it, or you're needing to, but somebody's going to tell you some fucking feist communication messages. But somebody could have got hit with the love arrow and it's coming towards you. It's coming to you. Um, you had to put a death to a third party situation, being stuck in a third party situation and not going towards what you love. That's what you put an end into. You put an end into that heartbreak and you're, you're moving towards, uh, this person. You're going to go to their house. This is the hermit. Um, you're, you're, you're moving towards what you're building. You have to let go of all those old issues on the inside and quit waiting on somebody to do everything for you. That's what it's saying to me because so, um, somebody wants a happy family with you, Ten of Cups. Somebody wants to have a successful marriage with you. Um, or you already do have a successful marriage and this third party was trying to ruin it maybe. It just takes story as it is, but then we got Queen of Pentacles, you know, and this is Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. This is this is somebody who is wealthy in the physical and in spiritual wealth. You're very knowledgeable. Look, this is a witch, see her broom. So uh, it's telling me that there's a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn that is 
need to remove the blindfold and they need to figure out, do you want me? Do you want me? Do you want me on the right or do you want on the left? Which one do you want? Right or left? Right or left? Be a high priestess. Have enough fucking discernment, common sense to know what you want. It's in your heart, okay? That's how you figure out what you want. That's how you do that. What, who do you love? It's in your heart. That's who it is you're supposed to go to. All right, then seven of cups, wish fulfill, you know, having a lot of options. Oh, ace of pentacles. Look here, your wishes is... See this right here? You're going to have love, money, freaking anything you want. You got the keys to all this shit. That's what it's saying. You got the keys to a lot of wealth. And it could be saying this king, this queen of pentacles is mad because you have options and you, you got an option of an offer of money coming to, towards you. Uh, whoever is... It could be a friend member because it pulled out earlier. They're... They wanted you to keep you waiting and watching them. They don't want you to do your your own thing. And I'm telling my collective, go and do your own thing like I'm trying to teach you all. Quit being stuck and scared to go off and get what in the hell you want. You're arising from this down coffin for a sword. You're, you had to rest and recoup. You, in your rest... Someone might be coming to you when you're resting at night, but all I think it's emer you're emerging a new being. You're you're becoming a success, a successful business owner, and uh, Page of Swords, some younger energy is wanting to come talk to you. Oh, they're wanting to partner up with you. They're wanting to partner up with you in business. That's what they want to talk about. They want to bring balance, temperance. <coughs> you know. They think that um, you're balanced in your masculine and feminine, and this could be somebody with wealth wanting to do it. It could be a Sagittarius wanting to come bring it. It could be. It could, could be, baby. You're going to have to have strength. you got to have a lot of strength. This will be a few months away, by the way. Whenever you're trying to go after what you're wanting, you have to have a lot of strength and courage now. Because somebody's a sitting perched or watching you. Look, they're perched high on the mountain and they're watching you. They're watching everything you do. Look how this man looks like he's hiding. See, he's watching everything you do. He knows that you're chopping off the heads of a lot of people. And that you got a lot of fucking knowledge and he appreciates you now. Oh, they're sitting and waiting on this tower to come. They've been waiting on this tower to happen so this new beginning could happen and stop feeling uh, trapped in their head. They're, they're tired of feeling trapped in their head now, and it could be an emperor. This emperor keeps spying at you now, and he knows that you're all supposed to come together. Will of Fortune come out? Karma. He knows that karma, you know, you had to stop these karmic cycles and patterns and... and uh, Put a death, ten of, ten of wands, you know, ten of swords, you know, put a death to all this old line betrayal and shit. You know, you got to put a death to that with this king of pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. You got to put a death to it. it. Look at that werewolf. He wants to overshadow you. He don't want you getting away. He wants to keep you stuck and depending on him, stuck and depending on him. He does not want you to be a successful, you know, queen of wands, a successful, exuberant, beautiful, creative success. He does not want you to do that. He does not want you to do it. This other man, this emperor wants you. This emperor knows you need to get away from this one person, Aquarius. They're playing with you. I think the emperor is watching and waiting because he knows that Karma's coming. Somebody's going to get death. Yep, for feeling like all was lost and not walking away. This got illuminated to you in the moonlight. Maybe that you completed out this cycle. Maybe you put an end to this or you're needing to put an end to this shit. 
This, this emperor wants to travel with you around the world. He don't want you to stay trapped up. See how that looks trapped up inside and not being able to go outside. And he just wants you to stop doing that shit because you are his wish fulfillment, Nine of Cups. Look there. His love is only for you, baby. You're everything he ever fucking wanted. He don't want nothing else in his life. He only wants you. And he knows that you're all supposed to... He wants to fucking marry you. He wants to marry you. And if you're in a marriage, he's watching you. He knows that this karmic partner of yours is going out and howling out at the moon going, Oh, you want to come fuck me? Oh, they hiding a lot of fucking secrets. He know, you know it, and you know, and he knows that that fucking person has caused delays in your all's relationship. And maybe you did because you was building a business, you know, you was building a business. You had to become balanced where you can give and receive equally. That's what this emperor is finally realizing. Um, that you wasn't wounded or feeling left out in the cold. You was, you, you still love them, you know, you still love them, but you was trying to, uh, to heal from somebody's death, I think. That's why Seven of Pentacles, I believe that's why it said that. And you had to defend what you built. You had to defend what you built, and you're going to receive accolades in a the community. They can't stop thinking of you. They cried their damn eyeballs out. Look, their eyeballs is gone. They've cried so much over you. They want to celebrate with you. They want to drink with you. They want to kiss you. They want to lick you. They want to fucking love you. They're tired of being left out and... and and uh, crying about you. They're tired of it. They want to uh, they want to get you into bed and love you. They want to fucking love you, Empress. They said, quit being tied up with this fucking tradition, Hierophant. Quit being tied up in this marriage where uh, you're unmasking that it's a karmic. They're a karmic. They're doing spells on you in the dark. You're, you're unmasking them. You're unmasking them. And you're building your wealth. You're building your wealth. You're building it. Nipper knows it. I love you all collective. Let me move these cards so I can put another reading. I hope y'all love my cards. And I hope that I kindly explained that story pretty good and people don't get mad. I just try to do a story and then go on. I know it can mean a bunch of shit, but hell, I mean, just listen to how I do it. Don't bitch about it, all right? If you want to bitch about it, then maybe you don't need to watch me, okay? As for some people, you guys... Because, you know, there'll be people, they'll come and they'll they'll be on my channel and then they'll delete me in a fucking minute or two. And people like that, I wish they would even stop coming to my channel. They'll come every day, take some, delete off, and then come back and subscribe next day, steal some more and delete. Fuck them people. Fuck them people. Yeah, that's what I said. Now, if this don't resonate with y'all, well, it might with somebody in my collective. So, remember what I'm telling you. Oh, this Divine Masculine was wanting to keep you a secret. Now he's missing that true love that you always gave to him, Divine Feminine. See, he wanted to keep you all a secret. Now he don't want to. And um, somebody is or was having an affair with a person at their work or someone that they worked for. Oh, uh, they're wanting to keep a secret that they're in love with you, and they went around lying and said you had an affair with them at work. Did you listen to that, Divine Feminine? Now, this is for one of us. They're judging you for things that they have done the same as you. Oh, well, they're a great judger, ain't they? Huh, what about that? They've done the same shit as you, and, and they're mad. And, and and you know that you don't need another person to make you feel good about yourself. You know how to heal your heart and love yourself. That's what Aquarians know how to do. I don't give a fuck what anybody says. That's why we're humanitarians. We love everybody. We can even get through these karmics. It doesn't matter. Give yourself time to be single. This divine masculine uh, is wanting you to be single. <laughs> And he feels like there is a sleeping giant that has awakened inside of him, okay? There's a giant that's awakened. Oh, and uh, should have stayed in their own lane and mind their own business. These people that was judging you for doing shit they'd done, they need to stay and mind their own fucking business, stay in their lane. 
And you don't need somebody else to make you feel good about yourself. I don't. And every every time somebody tries to put one over on me or you, all of my collective, you always show them that they can't play up the big dogs like you. You put them back in their fucking place. Good for you. Good for you. These people sin. They shouldn't fuck with you. Hang on. Somebody is, remember, the narcissist will create a smear campaign and try to add votes to his or her team, and they'll lie to anyone that listens to them. They forget to tell what they've done to you and all the abuse that they gave you. <laughs> Someone forgot to, they left out that missing information that they're a narcissist, and they want to be single, and they're lying, and they're saying they still want you, Aquarius. And you've been bringing back spice into your relationship, and your partner was happy about it. Your your partner was happy about it, but they're having a fire behind your back. Are you listening? The the reason that they're horny for you is they're having an affair behind your back. You got a sleeping whore on your hands, a sleeping giant whore. <laughs> and they're trying to put their own partner in harm's way. This is somebody's karmic husband or baby daddy. They're judging you, and they do this. They judged you for being a, a slut, and they said that that's what you was, Aquarius, and that's what they fucking are. They're doing it right now, I'll tell you, behind you back. And, uh, and and you wasn't allowed to have any friends or any time to your fucking self like you was under their control. You have to see that he's an abusive narcissist. Put that dog in the doghouse. Leave that bastard. Don't let these... And don't let these uh, other readers who poke at you have any response from you again, and you'll win. And that's what I learned, and that's what I learned. I'm not. Oh, and uh, they mad cause uh, somebody's mad cause uh, their husband doesn't pay them any attention anymore because they're a narcissist. And Divine Masculine's sister is saying that you wasn't good enough to, for him or to be his woman or to be his wife. He said you wasn't good enough. Whoever is divine masculine is that's single that you're all going after, or they might be married. I don't know, but collective. What's the most favorite thing you like about yourself? Ask your partner this and see what see their reply is good or not. See if their reply. You, collective. What's the most favorite thing that you like about yourself? You need to you need to write this down and ask your partner and see if your all's responses are the same. Then you'll know if. Are true for you. Uh, this woman wanted to make other people think that you was crazy, worthless, useless hoe. And now God is showing her that she was just a hoe hater, and she is a hoe. And God's going to put her in her fucking place for doing that to a chosen one. <laughs> you want to judge? You're all trying to judge me for the same shit you all have went and done? You should have stayed and minded your own fucking business. Because now your all's partner's gonna put you in harm's way, and then and they're gonna and they're gonna make everybody think that you're fucking crazy. But Divine Mask gonna say, when I first saw your face, I knew that we'd saw each other before my cupcake. I saw me through your eyes and knew we lived a many, many more lives. My cupcake. That's by me, pound. Nobody can steal. You're showing people you're a big fucking doll. These people just get mad. They're mad that somebody don't pay them attention. And, and the law knows who the damn hell all these people are. They know who they are that's doing wrong. They know. And they love that you're a beautiful old soul that helps others to see the truth. Okay? The law knows that you're a beautiful old soul that helps others to see the truth. That's what the that's what somebody's going to tell you. Shit, I about dropped him. Let me move all these. So remember, this person, uh, this reader that was poking fun, she likes having enough fires behind her partner's back. Judge me for you doing the same damn hoeing shit? Nah, you can't do that. I love, I'm a beautiful old soul, and I love all you readers that aren't against me. If, you know, if you've never seen me personally or you know you've never done nothing against me, this is not for you. It's for one in particular. That's the same color as me if that helps you any bit. She's going to be putting harm's way. Don't worry. Don't worry. I'm a big dog and I put her in her fucking place. She ain't the biggest dog. None of us are. We gotta learn each other that. We gotta learn each other that people, people, people now. 
Let me get a... Let me see what these cars do. My breeze, yeah. Where I go, I just don't know. What else does my collective need to be aware of today, Spirit? When I find my peace of mind, I'm gonna give you some of my good time. Protect yourself with prayers because people want to take what you've built. I told you somebody was trying to uh, steal from you, and I just noticed somebody was telling me about advanced protection. You're, they're telling me somebody's trying to steal what I built. Thank you, you two, for replying back to me. I appreciate you. They know I'm a chosen one. And we will always have people come after and betray us, but God reveals all who hurts us to redeem us. Thank you for that spirit. I love you. People is mad that you're a chosen one. Oh, and that you're going to Hollywood. I love you. And and, and, and that's great. And maybe you're, uh, you're somebody that keeps it totally real. You're a chosen one that lives out in Hollywood. And if you are, then you need to, you need to help me, our people. And the law knows that people's been tapping into your internet illegally and their asses is getting ready to go to check, to jail. And the law is watching all the neighbors around me and my collective. Somebody's been trying to fraud you. And it could have been somebody that lives in Hollywood. And their thumbs down in your videos. And um, what about that? This person that's doing it, she hates men. She thinks you hate men, but you just you just don't like her, man. That's all that meant, okay? What else? I love his spirit. I love how spirit tells a story, don't you guys? Oh, and someone in the legal system, someone in the legal system, a cop, magistrate, etc. They know that you're a chosen one. They know that you're a chosen one, and they know that you honor and love yourself, and you're different. They and they they appreciate you because you believe in uh, God. And plot twist, the story the story is changing. You're getting ready to go to Hollywood. Don't worry. Your story's selling. You're going to be famous, our Aquarius. I love you. And it's going to happen. And a storm is brewing up, and it's coming to the ones that sent dark energy towards me. It's going right back to these people that tried to fraud me. <laughs> it's coming back to you, thumbs downers. Thumbs downers. It could be a Gemini. It's all coming back to you. It could be a Gemini Taurus Cusper or a Gemini... Um, cancer cusper, but whoever you are, it's thumbs down on videos. Somebody is, uh, the law is watching you, and all that storm's coming right back to you. Are you listening? And, um, what else do we need to know? What else about these people? Someone is planning something sneaky behind your back. This person that thinks that you hate men. Uh, cause you're a chosen one. They're, they're planning something sneaky behind your back. It could be a man is going to leave you high and dry. Oh, but they want to keep you feeling depressed. But, you know, you're not depressed over them. You don't really care. But, um, this woman that's mad and thumbs down in your videos, Aquarius, uh, she has a, a curse over her life through sex with a, per a partner that did something to her. That's what it is. That's what it means, okay? And um, I love you guys, and I hope that this helps. Hang on. Oh, and your psychic and psycho pe psychic people can pick up on your energy and sense your true intentions too. So, I mean, you know, I know I'm a psychic, and and people can sense energy, and people can sense that. Somebody is trying to put a curse on you. They're trying to leave you high and dry. They want to keep you feeling depressed. They think they're more clever than you. They, um, they hate you. They hate you, and they're frauding you, and all this energy is going back to this person. Don't worry, and it could be a Gemini. They're very curious about you, but they didn't know that the story was changing and that that what it is, is everything I built, because I'm a chosen one, I'm getting ready to 
make it to be famous and be in the entertainment world in Hollywood. That's what I just said. Me and somebody in my collective. Whoa, peace. We're doing it. I love you guys. It's us. And and because we know how to honor and love ourselves, we're chosen ones. That's why. And uh, the legal system is watching everything these people's doing. Don't don't worry. Don't you worry now, hunty bunchies now. How? These idiots love to cause chaos and keep you in that five of ones energy. See, and the law knows that's what they is doing this whole damn time. And um, maybe it was this, uh, I'd, fight a I'd fight a bar for you, not a grizzly bar or a brown bar or even a panda, but maybe like a bar, like a car bar. I'd fight one of those sons of bitches for you for sure. This is my unknown. So maybe uh, this idiot... Uh, does car bar readings, and uh, they was cho they was choosing to, look, uh, to make it look like you live in chaos, and they might have did something to your videos. They was fraud, and they're stealing from you. They're stealing from you, and uh, you're you're needing to eat more greens so you can rise up in the spiritual process to to understand the rest of this. Oh, and uh. When people is jealous of others' gifts and what you have and your partner, what you all have, it only means that they're in a relationship where they have no true love like you do. They're jealous of your love. Huh? They're jealous of your love and they're mad because their person ghosted them or they could have ghosted you all, of course, but it's all right. Um, they're, they're shaky and nervous. Maybe you've been noticing and they're shaky. It's person that's on the internet stealing everything you do. They're mad because their person ghosted them and they keep praying that they're coming back. You're praying on a fucking wish that'll never happen. You know it. You gotta clear up karma and learn that, honey, lust is not love and you got to learn the difference between lust and love. Okay? If somebody ghosted you, they're not in love with you. Are you listening? I don't think so. And I think that that person that ghosted you, Aquarius, they're. They're doing voodoo on you, Divine Feminine, and you're aware that they can't get to you or ruin your reputation anymore, so they we just keep sticking you with pins. That's what they do to us, Aquarius. And, and it's a psychic person. Uh, they, they proclaim to be psychic, but they're not, because if they're anything like I was just talking about earlier, they get on my channel, they'll, they'll, they'll subscribe to my channel and fucking delete off the next day because they know I'm a psychic and I know that they stole something from me and I always blur them out. <laughs> and uh, they're getting angry at my readings. Well, don't watch them. Maybe it ain't for you. Oh, and this girl, she just wants you to be single, so she's going to try to keep doing shit to mess up your relationship. This person that's getting angry hits some younger person than you and... She's mad that you got a relationship that she can't mess up because somebody paid her to do magic and she ain't worth a fuck. And and, and, and they know that they they're got a warrant out for their arrest trying to have you murdered, attacked, or or word just because you're a chosen one. See, and I know this is true. So, maybe this person that ghosted you tried to have you murdered. <laughs> well, what about that? What about it? But spirit will always tell on us. Spirit will always lead me now. And that's true, Collector. Spirit's helped me so much. And Spirit said, now, by George, I told you all that rejection was for your protection now. And uh, you're helping people go through these dark nights of soul when all this shit's crumbling down and they feel lost and nobody around. You're helping them. You're helping them. And they're doing dick picture magic and her jack into your pictures that's what that means masturbation we just want to come and give you our banana we just want to come give you our banana i told you it was a tarot reader a tarot reader got paid to do magic on you a tarot reader did it and she might live out in hollywood but she doesn't have to but she knows that uh there's a positive change coming to you and karma is working in your life and in your favor so it's tarot reader she's going down in the law the law is watching you, Tarot Reader. Somebody in the legal system is watching you, Tarot Reader. You better sell away. <laughs> sell away from sending dick over here to a married woman. It's not going to work. Put your little nut sacks back up, buddies. It's not working. Okay? 
and you're a person that is stable and the haters will always try to throw you off your pipe and we know that and uh my collective they're going to go get their boom they're going to drive towards their banana that they want they're going to drive towards the man they want and nobody's going to stop them that's their man okay Sorry, you can't get it, but you don't have to be so jelly, jelly, <laughs> jelly, jelly, felly. Oh, and uh, they know that you have, like me, I have my stepson died you off for you new viewers. Uh, he, he killed himself at 17, and they know that this helps me. They know he helps me. They know it. And right here he is. He's a Gemini. Oh, and I love you, son, and I love you. I love you, son. You're so special to mama. Oh, wow. Well, and all that hard work is going to pay off when you go and work for your goals and dreams. You do your own work, you all, and don't steal. Because divine order got called, and a divine is working, and you don't have to worry about it. It's all going to come together the way it's supposed to. So don't worry, collective. It's all coming together ever so gently the way that it was supposed to. That's all that it means, okay? Let me give you some of these little messages. Let me get some more out of here. I don't know if it'll come out good or bad, you all. I got a lot of good and bad wrote in these little cards, so we'll see. I'm taking a little from here and there and everywhere, and I'm not using the same stack I did last time. So now let's see what it says. What's a little message that we need to know for the collective so it can help somebody? Some Somebody might drive a Mustang out here. Grandpa is going to kick that ice. Ooh. Grandpa's going to kick somebody's ice now. It's been doing all this wrong. <laughs> That's spiritual grandpa. It's dead. My grandpa died on me. You better watch out. Love grows where you water it. Oh, I have a grandpa. Ooh, and I used to have a Mustang. I love you, spirit. I love you. Oh, it says, uh, the stars brought you together to shine for all to see. This is what you and your partner does. The one that you water their love with. And somebody out here has a curse over their soul. This is that, this is that reader that loves stealing everything you do and, and, uh, and, uh, taking your style. She's, cause she's a, she's a cheater. She's married and she lies and she's a cheater. Uh, that's what it says. I mean, hell, I've cheated. I didn't lie about it. Now, well, what else? What else are y'all worried about? I, I'm, I'm, I'm the only big girl in Tarot that tells the fucking truth. I've never heard anybody else fucking say nothing. Maybe your spouse is cheating. If you drive a Jeep, you need to pay attention to their telephone, and it'll tell on them. Um, and, and you're progressing for forgiving your enemies. If you drive a Jeep or a Mustang, you're progressing for forgiving those enemies. You're meant to be a drug counselor or have a or have a pro, uh, have a something like me, you all. I always tell my collector to get on some box, and if they're bad off, if they don't have money to go to rehab, and I don't give a fuck who gets mad at me. There's nothing wrong with some box, and you can't overdose on it, and it will help you, so you won't search for drugs. It doesn't get you high, collective. It don't. So if you're worried about getting high, you're not gonna be able to get high off of it. Okay? Karmic don't want you to be with your true love. They know what you're meant to help many, many people, and they do not want you to be with your true love. Somebody's passed over grandpa. The deceased grandpa is helping, though. Or somebody's real grandpa in real life is. They tried to take you out. They tried to take you out because children is in your destiny, and you're mowing the lawn. You're mowing over all these idiots. You're mowing over all them idiots. Somebody that mows the grass every day. Wonder where you get your great ideas. I seen all your new cards. <laughs> You're getting mowed down. You want to push a dislike today? Go ahead. I'll start doing it to your channel and make my collective. So you better watch. Oh, you're going to be old and moldy by yourself. Uh -huh. Somebody's going to get... Somebody older is coming to your house. An unexpected visitor. Oh, God, you know who it is? Woo, two magicians that are magically delicious. 420 Twin Ray. That's who it's coming, baby. I love that spirit. So if you know a Taurus, it's birthday's 420. Your Twin Ray's coming to you, baby. And they said, hit, they've hit subscribe to your channel. And they're telling you to forgive and move on from that damn purpose. person. They don't want you to be with them. They want you to be with them. They love you. 
and they know your karmic's always a bitching about something. They're old and moldy, and they want to have an equal give and take relationship with you, collective. And reality is you're in separation from them, and that's all that it was, and, and you wasn't crying over it anymore. You all had to detach so it could come to you ever so gently and naturally, and that's what it's doing, and God loves you, and I love you, collective, and hit subscribe if you're new, and give me a comment. You're a caring and nurturing mother, collective. The police got called on you. Incestual demons. Oh, the police get called on somebody that incested you? That put a demon on you? What's wrong with people? They called the police, somebody that put, that did incest with you. This uh, person, this cook that scratches his and her ass, these people is the one that did it. They're fucking stupid. Their karma's hitting them back in the face for lying to the police. They took you for granted, these people did, these old and moldy people, because you're a star, baby. They took you for, for granted. They took, all they was doing was pushing for more answers. That's all they was fucking doing. And that was wrong with them people. That was wrong with them to uh, go t talk in your name and bullshit on your name. You're going to be living large and feeling in charge out in Hollywood, baby. And mama didn't raise no damn fool. And that's what the damn whole story is, Aquarius. Mama didn't raise no damn fool. We we are picking up on all this energy. And we know we got to forgive and move on and, and uh, push for more answers. We need to live large and in charge. 420 says, come to me, baby. You're my star. We're going to be magically delicious. This spouse of yours is cheating. It could be with somebody in your family, like incest. They took you for granted. This cook or two cooks were stupid for calling the police over you. What's wrong with people? They got a curse over their soul. You're not crying over these people anymore. You're carrying a nurturing mother. You want to receive an unexpected visitor. It could be somebody that drives a Jeep. And the reality is you was in uh, separation. And the karmic's always bitch because children is in your destiny. This is just an old and moldy son of a bitch. Grandpa, that needs to forgive. That needs to forgive and move on. They tried to take you out. You're mowing the lawn with them. You... Love grows where you water it. Hit subscribe. Hit subscribe, people, because you're supposed to be a drug counselor, and that's for somebody in my collective, and the stars brought you together because the karmic don't want you to be with your love because you, they know that you'd be an equal give-and-take relationship, and he's going to buy you a Mustang now, he or she. They might drive a Mustang or a Jeep. But, you know, that's just what it is. And I love y'all. And I, and if you appreciate me, would you please hit subscribe? And don't take personal readers. If you have never done nothing to me personally, it wasn't about you. It's about readers that know exactly who the fuck they are. It's done something to me. And the law knows who they are. And that's all that it means. And that's what it is. And I love you guys. And uh, I hope that y'all have a wonderful day. And y'all work hard and got your goals and dreams. Because these idiots want to keep doing voodoo on you but you protect yourself with powers because you're a psychic and you're psychic and you know these people that's mad at my readings they got rejected they got rejected and that's why they went through a dark night so all of them did and i know it you all went through it and it's okay we're rising up because we're a chosen one and we have spiritual people helping us. And all these people that tries to mess with relationships, try to be stupid, they're going to, they're going to be, uh, karma is the law is following you around. Karma is law is following you around. That's the karma. The law is following you around. People that does this and steals from internets. All because you're mad at people that is in a relationship and you're not getting dick because you're a jealous motherfucker and you're jealous of others' gifts. You're going down and people that try to take out a chosen one, well, and paid tarot readers to do shitty magic, it's all coming back to you. Lust energy's coming back. Take all that lust and throw it back to that reader that's lust and horny and all they talk about is coming and jizzing in your face. 
Send it right back, because that's all y'all know how to do is come and jizz and take from everybody. It's got a lot of motherfucking knowledge. It's lived a marriage and can speak on it. Women's never did that. Well, they're goofy, and they shouldn't be speaking on shit they've never had to live or endure, you know? Like, like incest or rape, you don't need to open your mouth about it. There's karma attached to it. All right, and I love you guys, and I hope this helps somebody out there today. And I thank you guys, and... um. When are you and Divine Masculine going to come together? When When is that going to be for my collective spirit, please? And Oh, gosh, in nine days or nine weeks, something is coming to an end. So nine days or nine weeks for one of, some of you, and in 12 days or 12 weeks for some of you. It is going well now. So when this shit comes to an end, you'll be better in 12 weeks, all right? Alright, I love you guys and please like, subscribe and share. Pa -pa 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 pieces.